Hi, Zach Pater here at River Valley Marina, River Valley Power and Sport in Red Wing, Minnesota. What a treat to take you through today. This is an absolutely beautiful 1990 50-foot Gibson houseboat. Absolutely incredible boat inside and out. The uh, boat owners here have done a ton of great updates to it, some of which will stand right out, including all the new decks. Uh, they have all been painted. Just uh, beautiful furnishings in front. All new upholstery work outside on this boat and just generally very clean looking. Take a quick walk down the outside of this boat. See they got the plank to go up to the front of the boat. All the shore cords, fenders, tie lines, barbecue grill are all going to come with the boat. Very good looking bridge. We're going to actually jump up there. Nice big wide walk arounds on these 50 Gibsons making it very easy to get around the boat. Work our way down. You can see you got nice big windows. We'll see that more once we get inside the boat. Uh, Gibsons, they do have the option to have davits on the back. This one here, you can see the davit package. You can also see the aluminum ladder along with the boarding ladder. Nice big back decks. The back engine compartment lid has been totally rebuilt and replaced. We'll take a closer look at that once we hop on board. So let's take a quick look. Uh, we're going to hop actually up on the top of this boat and we'll go through the exterior, then we'll hop inside. All right, we're going to work on looking at a uh, closer look at the outside of the boat. And you'll notice the front deck here, just a great place for entertaining. This really becomes a social uh, atmosphere, if you will. The nice bill over the front keeps you a little bit in the shade, keeps the rain off you. That nice big bench in the front. You also have storage down below and you got two nice big anchors here right in the front. I also like how they did the canvas around the front, just gives it some nice eye appeal. All right, we are now worked our way to the back of the boat. Again, those nice big davits there. Take a walk up the ladder here. You've got a nice three easy steps and it gets you right up on top of the deck where you've got this beautiful furniture up here that's gonna come with the boat. It's got an umbrella. Beautiful decks again that were repainted. Nice aluminum railings all the way around. You have a TV antenna mounted here. Work our way up to the flybridge again. Nice furnishings. And then all the blue upholstery here that wraps around has all been redone. You also have a nice big bimini top and then he's got a bridge cover as well. Again, just a very, very good looking boat for uh, being a 1990 and just a lot of room on this boat. It's hard to, hard to in video to really show the amount of room that you have outside and inside. All right, so that's a quick look on the outside. Let's uh, jump inside the cabin. All right, so we jumped inside and the heart of a houseboat, obviously is the inside of a houseboat, where you really can make them into what you want. This particular boat has nice carpeting, very big sofa here. You have a, a little coffee table, if you will. And again, you could update this and do anything you want to it. Entertainment center with the TV, also a small little bar area. Simply flip up the lid, you got some places for glasses, little sink, ice bucket. Work our way back forward, you got a couple of nice chairs sitting in here. And again, you can really do anything you want inside these houseboats, which is really nice. Paneling looks all very good. Very sharp looking helm station. I don't want to I don't want to walk past this cuz this is very nice. VHF radio, the Garmin up there. Just a good looking overall uh package down here engine hour meters here you can see we got uh, 728 roughly and 733 on that one so a very low houred boat here all right let's continue through here we'll work our way to the back of the boat and uh, very nice open concept with this uh, 50 Gibson the flooring down by the kitchen has all been redone and it looks very sharp very big galley lots of storage stainless steel sink updated faucets there your electric cooktop with an oven simply flip it up you got three burners there and your oven down below all electric as we look back across from the galley you're gonna see the uh, door to the head compartment you also have the refrigerator which has been updated along with a uh, pantry behind us simply flip it open and you got a nice uh, pantry there for uh, storing all your dry goods. All right, we are gonna keep working our way to the back of the boat where this beautiful master stateroom awaits. This is 
absolutely awesome. The headroom, the windows, the uh, beautiful storage, closet space, just really makes that staying overnight on the boat extremely comfortable. Um, lots of room, there's another head door here as well, but a very, very good looking master stateroom, if you will, for this size boat. You also have steps that can go through the back door as well. Gibson also did a nice job with closet space, making it just nice and easy, along with some nice drawers and uh, space down there. Great spot to even set a TV. All right, we are gonna work our way into the uh, main head compartment here. Again, that nice flooring kind of continues throughout there, which is very sharp. Your vanity here, mirror, nice wall coverings all the way around. And then you do have the shower with tub right behind the curtain here. Simply flip that open. You've got a towel bar up above, your shower, and then the tub down below, all fiberglass lined, all in very nice shape. And I mentioned before, there is a, an entrance into the head right from by the uh, galley here, so making it nice and easy to enter that way as well. All right, we are gonna take a walk down to the front of the boat, the only area we really haven't looked at quite yet. So we will uh, venture through the boat here and we are gonna go down these forward steps, which are going to take us down to the forward head compartment, along with the forward sleeping area. Work your way down here. You can see there's some nice uh, storage areas here off to our right. And then as we get down in here, you will notice the twin beds. They are very roomy. It's very big, nice lighting down here. Just a great setup on this uh, 50 Gibson. As we worked our way down the steps, you'll also notice that forward head compartment. Just very, very good looking uh, setup here for a uh, quick, easy day head on this uh, houseboat here. So one area that I kind of skipped over here that I wanted to come back to was this uh, motor compartment, primarily because it is just very sharp and clean. This uh, lid was completely rebuilt. You can kind of see that's all fresh and new. Take a look at this motor compartment. It is, uh, generally speaking, for the age of the boat, it's very clean, the motors are very clean, run great, your generator, the bilge is, uh, generally speaking, dry. Just everything looks sharp and crisp. I go into so many of these boats and they just don't look very nice. And I hop inside this and that is just a very sharp looking motor compartment on a uh, boat of this age. All right, so that there is gonna wrap up our video walk around here, this very good looking 50 foot Gibson, a boat that truly should not disappoint for its age and for the price. Very good looking boat. I think you should be impressed inside and out, mechanically and cosmetically. So please, I'm Zach Pater here at River Valley Marina, River Valley Power and Sport in Red Wing, Minnesota. I appreciate you taking the time to view my video today. Please call, text, or email with any questions or to set up a time to view. And I hope you appreciated watching our video. Thanks again and have a great day.